Hello ladies and gentlemen, here is a video review of Transformers Prime Voyager Thundertron. This video is conducted by Robot Kingdom. The Thundertron comes from the newly released Transformers Prime Voyager Wave 4. He is neither an auto nor a Decepticon. He is seeking revenge for the his home world. Okay, let's have a look at the box. Just like all the other Voyager Primes, it has the name on it and um, an open window that you can you can see clearly how it looks. And also on this side, you have the technical data, you have the description, and on the back there's a picture of both the robot mode and the lion mode. So here we have opened a Thundertron, so you can have a look at how the articulation and the painting is. So firstly for the shoulder you can move upward, downward and forward. Also you can turn it, uh, you can, also you can rotate it. Here for the elbow joint there is uh, around 90 degrees of articulation and also is it comes with a um, clear blue plot over here. <coughs> so for the leg, you can also move forward and backward and a little bit outside. Okay. And here it can move around a little bit more than 90 degrees. And the feet here there's a ball joint so you can um, move a little bit. But on this side, because it is designed to detach like this, so it doesn't move as free as the, this one. And on the back, there are some amazing paint job here. You can see that um, the paint is uh, changing from silver to blue here. And for the weapons, this one you can attach on the on the arm and move like this to form a sword. Of course, uh, similar to all other Voyagers series, uh, it cannot be locked. It so once you unpress it, it will move back to the original position. The other weapon you can detach the leg, so it forms like a pirate. And you can attach the the feet on he, on this side like this. Okay, let's move to the transformation sequence. First of all, you need to flip the part on the head back here, and then it's better to move this to close backward first. Afterward, you can flip over the base head to the back. Okay. Here you can see that the the robot mode head is already covered. And here these two parts you move inside and these two panels you move backward. Okay. So the the transformation of the head is already done. And here this is the chest part. Uh, in robot mode is flipped like this and in the lion mode it will pop out automatically so for the arms first you need to hide the hand first and then these two joints you can move it inside like this And then you need to rotate the claw this way on both sides. And here, there's a joint that you can clip on here. 
So you press it and then you can move the arm in this way and turn it here and there's also a joint over here this one you need to put it, put it here okay. and also the same on this side you put it together and rotate put this joint together okay and afterward you need to put this to cover the hand part okay oh. okay this is like this okay Okay, for the lower body, it's much simpler. You just need to uh, rotate the leg in this way, and then rotate the feet, and also flip this two over, over to the back. And the same for this this side. Okay. And twist it, make it looks like a animal rear leg. And here you need to put it back. It's a little bit tight. Yeah. Okay. Ah, also here these two legs you need to move open a little bit. Okay. Then here is the lion mode of the transform primes. Voyager Thundertron. So lastly you can have a look at the lion mode of Thundertron. So here is the head. Um, for the front leg you can only move this part because it's locked it here. And also of course the, the feet too. Yeah. You can rotate a little outside or inside. And here Here is the rear part, which is uh, you can move like the original leg, also with the same articulation. And with the tail here, there's a joint, so you can move a little bit up or down, like this. And these two panels you can move as you like. Also. You can install the weapon on the hole here. Okay. So, this is the video review of Thundertron. Thank you for watching.